how to add tabs to your Wix website. Hey everyone and welcome. I hope you're all doing great. In this video, I will show you step by step how we can add tabs to our Wix website. So basically, tabs are going to be a section on your store where you can just go ahead and create multiple tabs where people can just go and filter between them and read more stuff. This is going to be some sort of a design thing that could make your website a like much better looking and you don't really have to um you know if you have a lot to say but you don't really want it to be all uh vertical you can just go ahead and combine them all in one tab uh, and people can just go ahead and read all of them so this is a great way to use this uh thing so we can just go in and get started first you will need to just open up your website and click on edit site and then from here, you basically uh, want to first make way for your tabs section. Now it is going to be a uh, rectangle. So you, you want to just make a new section, preferably to um, have that uh, tabs in, in a good position, basically. So we can just go ahead and add it right below the welcome here. So I'm just going to create a new blank section. And then we can just go ahead and start by adding elements. It's one of the elements. So we just want to go to add elements. And then you want to go to the box section. And you want to go to the tabs section and pick any tab that you want. So I've picked this one. There's going to be like uh, around five to six of them. And you can always just change how it looks if you want. Uh, for example, you can just go to uh, design. And then from here you have all the... Uh, different tabs that we can actually actually select so we have all of these that you can actually go for i'm just going to stick with the one i've just uh picked which is this one right here uh and we can just go ahead and also customize this design from here so if you just click on design again click on customize design and obviously you'll be able to change the background color for it um for example here you can actually see if we make it more um colorful is going to change the background color but apparently it's not doing much so let's just go ahead and try the um other colors here so let's just go down here and this is the container let's see the tabs themselves if we just go to shadows here or background fill for the uh, sh for the tabs themselves we can actually change that color but for some reason the tab container is not really changing i think it's going to be the the uh edges of the actual tab let's go ahead and try things uh out here as well so for example we can try the scroll button we can also change that and we can also change the container themselves which i believe is what i was trying to change at first yes there you go so you can as you can see you can just basically change out the um colors for them accordingly uh, i'm just going to leave them as it as they are and here i'm just going to go back to uh orangey here and with the hover i'm going to also make it uh, maybe red or something okay so what can we actually adjust with the tabs themselves first you can obviously adjust the sizing for it you can make it um take the whole section out so for example like this so it is pretty much a full screen and now people will be able to filter between all the tabs here now how do we actually adjust each tab and what is included within it so first you would want to click on manage tabs and the ones that you don't want you can just feel free to delete and the ones that you actually want to keep you can just basically um, keep them like so and you can always just add more tabs so let's just go ahead and add a new tab and name it uh, test tab so how do we add stuff within this tab so first click on it and then uh, you want to just open it up first and then you can just go back to add elements and you can just feel free to add whatever you want to this tab. Just go ahead and uh, as you're dragging it, just make sure it says attach to tab and you can just feel free to edit the text uh, accordingly. So we can just add some um, test text here. I know it's not visible yet, so let's just go ahead and change the color for it. If we just select the entire thing here. Um, and change the color for it as you can see and we can also add more stuff like any other element that we can actually add we can just basically uh, move it to this tab for example i'm just going to add uh, an image so let's just go to images upload images and i'm just going to select 
uh, an image here real quick. Let's just upload this color purple. I already have it, so I'm just going to click on Add to Page. And again, just move it wherever you want from within the tab itself, obviously. Just make sure it says uh, Attach to Tab. And now we're pretty much set. Uh, we can just go ahead and click on Save and Preview. Once it actually saves, we can just go ahead and preview the sites. And you can see now we have test tab, we have bowls, we have smoothies, and you can see now that basically are fully functional now. Just make sure you customize the design to your liking. And this is all for this video. Hopefully you found this video to be helpful and thanks for watching.